Welcome back to the 24 seven sports live stream. I'm Steve Wiltfong and you know, you know who you're here to see four-star defensive lineman, Terrence Green from Cywoods High in Cypress, Texas. Terrence, congratulations. How are you? I'm doing good. Thank you. I appreciate it. Yeah, absolutely. Terrence, you, you racked up close to 30 scholarship offers. You narrowed it down to Michigan State, Miami, Oregon, Texas, and USC. What were you looking for in a college football program? Uh, a place where I could build a relationship with the coaches, and I think I'll be able to be developed uh, and reach my goal, which is making it to the NFL. Six foot five, 265 pounds. Terrence, you moved into the starting lineup as a junior. Early in the season, you racked up four sacks against Shadow Creek, a state powerhouse. That was kind of your coming out moment. The scholarship offers followed Lamar, then Texas Tech, and they poured in after that. What type of player are you? What are you bringing to the next level? Uh, I'll say dominance and uh, me being able to use my length. So that's to make plays and uh, you're going to get a leader too. You had so many great programs to choose from. How did you narrow it down to these schools? Uh, really just coaching relationship, um, them being in uh, contact with me all the time, and uh, really the facilities and everybody just showing love and uh, telling me how to go use the NS team. How long have you known what you're going to do, what you're about to announce here? Uh, I didn't know for, uh, for long. Uh, I made the decision like really like a day or two ago and handed it down, and I'm happy with my choice. Great. Well, the floor is yours to tell everybody where you'll be playing your college football. All right. Uh, first off, I would like to thank the man up above because without him, it wouldn't be possible. Uh, he blessed me in many ways that I'll forever be grateful for, uh, which is allowing me to play the game I love at the next level. Uh, second, I would like to thank my family for supporting me through this crazy but incredible journey. Special thanks to my mom for being my backbone throughout this whole process and supporting me uh, no matter where I choose to go. And, um, also, it's her birthday yesterday, so happy birthday to her. And she's the reason I chose to commit around this time. And then also I want to say thanks to my little sister, Taryn, and my grandparents who are sitting next to me, always believing in me and being the best grandparents I could ask for, no matter if it was football or basketball. Um, I'd like to thank my friends, my teammates, uh, for helping me make memories on and off the field. Um, we fought hard last year, but I'm going to fight harder this year and go deep into the playoffs and compete for state championships. Um, and to my high school coaches, I appreciate you all. Coach Stemper, Coach Brown, Coach Lowry, Coach Bradford, Coach Mitchell, Coach Carter, Coach Lane, Coach Plum, Coach Turnbow, Coach Claire. Um, I appreciate you all filming me along the way and teaching me things on the field, as well as life lessons, life lessons off the field that will make me a better man. And to the staff of Coach's organization, thanks for allowing me to be a part of greatness. And I'm, I'm proud of all the alumni chasing their dreams. And so I always thank you. And then I just want to thank um, all the colleges who um, gave me an offer and believed in my talents. Um, he something to me that a lot of people didn't, and I appreciate that. And so, um, for thinking uh, about last night, um, I narrowed it down to three. Uh, yeah, Texas, this one's fake. Uh, we got Oregon. So the next three to four years, I'll be taking my uh, academic and athletic career. I'll be going to Oregon University. Terrence, Terrence, congratulations on your commitment to Oregon. Commit number 12 for Dan Lanning and the staff. Your pledge moves to Oregon from number 23 to number 16 in the 24-7 sports composite team recruiting rankings. What set Oregon apart for you? Uh, really just the coaches, uh, the relationship I build with them. Uh, I've been there twice. When I went there on my second visit for uh, my official visit, I knew it was home. And um, they all showed love. love the facility, but it's the people that make it uh, home for me. I appreciate every one of them. 
a couple guys or a few guys you mentioned, Coach Lanning, Coach Lupoy, Coach Tony. Uh, what stood out about those guys in the direction of the program under this new Oregon staff? Uh, Coach Lane is a great guy. He came fresh off uh, the Natty last year. He knows what it takes to get there. And then with uh, Coach uh, Lupoy and all them, I believe it would be great. Uh, I just trust them that they'll be able to uh, develop. Following that four sack game against Shadow Creek, did you see yourself playing at a place like Oregon, or did you see yourself staying closer to home early in the process? And then the duck blew you away with those two visits. I never really minded uh, staying home or not. Uh, distance didn't really matter, but just somewhere I could trust the people and that they'll take care of me uh, when I leave home. And that's what they've done. Uh, but I didn't know it was going to be Oregon or UT or Michigan State, but just taking the business helped me figure that out. And you said that you, you settled in on Oregon, the finality of it last night. Just what are some of the other things that caught your eye about that football program and that school? Uh, uh, the coaches that they brought in, that Coach Landon brought in, um, the culture they have out there, they care about faith, family, and football. That's something I stand by and me and my family stand by. Last thing from us, Terrence, Oregon's been in the Pac-12 title game a couple times over recent years, four straight number one recruiting classes in the Pac-12. Where's this 2023 class going to help take the dust in the future? Uh, I think we're going to uh, take it and build something special. Um, now that I, you know, I announced, I feel like I can get my recruiting hat on and get some of these other guys on board. And, uh, this one's special and win a lot of games and compete for a natty one day. Yeah, well, thank you, Terrence, for committing here on 24-7 Sports. Thanks to all of y'all for tuning in. That's Terrence Green, newest member of the Oregon Ducks. Stay tuned to 24-7 Sports in this live stream for Hunter Osborne's commitment, a four-star defensive lineman from Alabama, at the top of the next hour as he chooses between Alabama, Clemson, and Tennessee, and Texas, among others.